Studio, I'm beginning a new uh, multicolor print. This one has a coffee theme. Uh, it's going to be created for a friend of mine who loves her morning coffee. And it's just kind of a fun, joyful print. And I'm about to get started on the first color, which is the brown of the latte. Before I can get started with printing, I need to transfer my artwork to the block and carve the block itself. So I've done the first color, the brown, of the print and I've also built myself a jig that will hold the um, artwork in the same place every time. So when I'm doing multiple colored layers, the prints, the subsequent layers of the print will line up. And this is just a jig made out of foam core and you can see that the artwork slides right in. I've got two pinholes on the bottom and those actually are going to line up with the holes that I've punched in my paper. So watch the process as we go through and you'll see how that's done. So here I am applying the first color brown to the block, rolling out my custom made ink and applying it on my block. And I'm gonna try a little technique that I'm going to use a slightly damp Q-tip to rub away some of the ink, to give it that sort of multi-textural look of a foamy latte on the top. So here you see me sliding it into the jig to hold it in position. Get a piece of paper. Got my blank piece of paper and I've got the holes punched in it which will line up with the jig here. fall naturally on the paper and then just rub the back with my barren. Just want to make sure for this first test print we get a nice clean pull. Pretty good. I might refine that top a little bit, but... I'm now ready to proceed with the second layer of the print. It's going to be uh, black over top of the brown of the latte. And at this stage, what I need to do is remove anything that I want to occur in brown in the final print. So that would be the latte foam and various parts of the cup. I've decided to do a graduated line in the background just to make the print a little bit more interesting. And so here I get going on finishing the carving so I can prepare it for the next layer. I've run a test print of the second layer. This is the uh, black plate that's going to be going over the brown. Basically here is the uh, test print that I've run and I'm pretty happy with the combination of the browns and the blacks, so I'm gonna proceed with printmaking. Interestingly enough, here's the sketch that I produced for the same print. So it's pretty close to what I had imagined it to be, which is neat. <laughs> 